this week's quips, uh, same as the UDU podcast, uh, quip stands for questions, insights, provocation, statements. If at any stage you have some upland quips or anything you want to touch on that we could dive in on in this podcast, let me know what they are via a Discord DM. I have changed that up from the Google form because the old Google form is UDU podcast form. I will get a new one up ready for the next recording, hopefully. Um, and of course, if your submission is used in a show, you'll win yourself some kind of prize. So this week, Caesar, long-term supporter of the show, asks, is it possible that the earnings will not be reduced anytime soon? Meaning the Upland dividend earnings, he goes on to say, I mean, Upland could reduce the yield and keep the new T1, Tier 1 cities minting prices the same as before. But as we see, the 14% is still there, although minting prices are much bigger. Will it be the new trend from now on? So, so you said you, you weren't really chasing dividends, but it's kind of something you're thinking about. It's something I know I should do um, in order to maximize my account potential. Yep. But I still very much play it as a game. Um, the only difference for me is instead of putting, you know, all my money on packs on Candy Crush or these mm. other mobile games, I'm, or even on Fortnite, you know, buying skins that I get to wear once in a blue moon when I feel like playing it, it it's going into something that I'm active in generally, like daily. So mm. it's. Yeah, I know I should be working towards dividends, but a lot of the time if I see a nice house for a nice price in a decent area, I'm likely going to grab it and because it's pretty, I'll hold it. Uh, Lily just said that she tracks hers, but she doesn't focus on it and she's at 13% of property mint. Nice. All right, so yeah, that's a that's a smart play that a lot of people can do nowadays. Is if you are heavily focused on dividends, you can just go along and gobble up all the undermints, and you get a you get a killer rate there. You know, some of these properties are selling for 30 percent of the um of the mint price. So yeah, no, if you can play that game, that's that's definitely in your favour. I know if you go to Upex Land and you look at people's um accounts, it's got the graphs. You know the whatever the two prices are, the mint price and the net worth. And I know my graph is the two lines are very heavily separated because I spent so much UPEX buying up secondary market in places like Midtown Terrace and whatnot. But there's plenty of people where theirs have flipped. So if, if you can get hold of that, good on you. Now, oh. Susan's question was, do we think that the the yield is going to reduce anytime soon? Hmm. Well, it has been quite a while. It would not surprise me well, to see it drop this year. Yeah, yeah. I reckon there'll be at least one or two each year until they've reduced it to a level they're happy with. Yeah. And I can see Lily's followed up there and say say that she buys LA often under mint, but only the ones she likes in areas that she likes. But then, she, yeah, you also pay five times for something that you just want in a different area, which kind of, you know, balances it out i guess <laughs> yeah i as i said i would not be surprised to see the dividend of uh, dividend rate drop i what do you think where did we go we were at 17.3 percent when we started and it's down to 14 point something isn't it i would expect if we have another drop it might take us to the 12 maybe something like that well actually uh, i actually know sorry sorry finish your thought we just need another layer two to bring in extra house utility, bring in a rental system. I mean, how mind blowing it is it that there there isn't a layer one rental system or a layer one kickback for putting a building up or something like that? So, yeah, that drives me bananas. That, but I actually know exactly when the dividend rate's going to drop. I know exactly the dividend rate is going to drop as soon as my um, dividends tick over two million upex again. <laughs> So that's what happened last time. I'd I'd been grinding like a fiend for years and finally kicked over the two million and it was literally within days that she got X and I was way back down again. So yeah, there you go. Hit it here first. And I'm getting close. Well, you've, so you've said it, you'll manifest it now. 
Yeah.